Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode here of XCOM 2, the Call of Duty Modern Warfare campaign. I hope you all have a good afternoon, good morning, good evening. We are here with Operation Brooding Rain. The objective is to raid the Advent Train. It is a moderate difficulty. I was going through the mods and the mod pack for the firearms mod and the uh, the thing that we got in the last episode with the uh, magnetic, t magnetic tears. There's nothing on there that suggests that uh, of, of the direction to go with the, the weapons and whatnot, other than it looks like that not really anybody else had a problem. There was one, somebody that had asked, how do you get them higher so, or higher tiers? But nobody else on the, the, the mods themselves were asking about it. So I can only assume that people eventually figured it out, which I hope we will eventually figure it out. Um, I, I, I can hope. I can hope and pray, because if I am only facing enemies with base weapons, then that's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be very interesting. Alright, so, here we go. We got Vasquez, Gaz, Captain Price, uh, Ghost, and Roach. Here we go. Going on a retaliation mission for this one, or not a retaliation but mission, but a supply mission and everything. Sky Ranger deployed. Squad green to deploy. And here we go. We've got a lead on a disabled advent train that was hit by resistance operatives working in this area. There's still the potential to recover valuable technology here, so we're moving to capture whatever we can. We'll need to secure the area and remove any hostile forces still defending the train if we're going to make this work. Sounds like a plan. Let's go ahead and go down there. Coordinates of the advent train are locked in. Move to secure. Eliminate all hostiles. We're gonna move Gaz to here. Kinda of just starting off. We're gonna move um Roach. Moving. To cover there. Without the introduction of human DNA, these creatures once operating under the guise of thin men now show their true form. A purely reptilian species. No reason for them to hide. The aliens don't need an infiltration unit anymore. Stay clear of those turrets. We're still not entirely sure if they're fully automated or remotely triggered. Moving out. We're just going to move various people into various positions and whatnot. We're going to move Price over this way. Now, if we do fire on these guys, we do need to be cautious of the fact that we do have a turret to deal with, but I think I know how we want to take care of these guys. I think I know exactly how I want to do this. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to take Price and we're going to go Overwatch, maybe? Nah, I don't think we're going to take Price and do Overwatch. What I will do... I'm gonna go ahead and just do this with um with Gaz. I have a visual. Okay. Hopefully the Viper moves forward. Or you know, back to there where there's potentially more uh more enemies. You know, good. Nice hit. Nice hit. Heading out. I've got eyes on advent troops. Okay, more advent troops over here. Bad idea, but you know it's I think it'll be fine. This is actually a really bad idea. 
Um, Vasquez, uh, what do I want to do? Heading out. I don't exactly know. I do know that that turret's going to be a problem. Nice. Hostile terminated. Could do slash, which isn't a bad idea, but it will leave price exposed, and they could potentially use a grenade on here. I'm going for it anyways. was luck right there. Oh, what? What? Oh my god, here comes, the, here comes the third one. Okay, Price is unconscious. This is not good. Oh, no. Okay. I can't revive with Roach, unfortunately. On your order. Let's try this flank shot with Vasquez. Oh. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. On the move. Target eliminated. Beautiful. Okay. So we'll see what this guy does. He could call in reinforcements. He might not. Oh, he's piecing out. Roger that. So yeah, price is down, which is not good. Try this shot downtown. Oh, nice hit! That was beautiful. Wow. Okay, I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. I'm gonna get some top cover here and hope that there's nobody on this other side at the moment. Okay, good. We're gonna take a moment to do a few reloads here, real quick. Oh yeah! Go help him out. Sure, I'll heal up Price. God, it's gonna take him a bit to have a better mission. Scanning. Gonna good. do a reload here. Moving to Overwatch. Loading. Yeah, Price is just having a really rough time. On your okay, we got more Advent Forces, a Sectoid, and two Troopers. Nothing that we haven't, you know, experienced before. Ah, Ghost. Oh, Ghost. Oh, boy. Okay, what I am going to do is this. I'm going to move Vasquez behind here. I mean, it's a 50-50. I think I'm going to do a protocol on um, uh, Roach over here with Vasquez. I don't use that nearly as much as I should. No! 
Nope. I mean, we did hit him, but like once. You have got to be kidding me. Oh my freaking god. Wow. I have a few ideas on how I want to handle this. Predominantly starting with that. Yeah, nothing. Oh boy. Okay, you wasted a turn there. Alright, right, what I am going to do with Gaz... First off, I'm going to kill this trooper, hopefully, with somebody. What I'm going to do with Gaz is I'm going to go ahead and pick up, um... Price. Okay, there we go. Heading out. Gonna move Roach over to here. Massive crits. Massive crit chance there. On your order. Miss. Okay. Shot wide. And I think I'm going to call in a Sky Ranger and get, um, Gaz out of here. With Price, both of them are going to need to have a good mission. Not this mission, but at some point. Okay, come on, Roach. Smoke him. Hostile terminated. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Okay, nine, um, uh, nine enemies terminated. We got two wounded, unfortunately. <sighs> oh, well. It happens. It happens. My ideas aren't always the best, but it didn't get him killed. Which was more by luck than anything else. Let's go back to base. I will. I I said to myself, they're gonna have a great mission. They're gonna have like a really fantastic mission. Gaz and Price. Maybe I should just stop saying that. Honestly, I think I should. How Price isn't dead at this point is really kind of mind-blowing. It, it really is shocking how he's not dead. Maybe I need to remove the cigarette. Maybe that's the, maybe that's what's drawing their fire is the, the cigarette light here. Maybe that's it. Let's go back to base. I gotta tell you though, had it been four soldiers, I don't know if we would have done that well. All right, Vasquez, you are going to be. I'm just looking at the teams. You and Roycewitz are like the, the specialists on this, so I'm gonna give you Battlefield Medic and Roycewitz can have Combat Hacker. Price will have um 
Shadow Step. Ghost. Deadeye. And Roach. That's right, you're gonna have Revival Protocol. Man, we could have used that this mission. I gotta tell ya. Definitely could have used it. Alright, well that's... that. I mean, all things considered, that was a pretty good mission. Low on Engineers. Yeah, we kinda do need Engineers. Well, the Black Market's open. You don't say! Avenger plotting new course. I think I could use the black market open at this point. Let's do that. Nice long shot is done. Uh, let's go back to the Gorilla Tactics School real quick and let's get uh, Griggs in here for some Grenadier training. There you go. Power relay now operational. Nice, that power relay is done. Sweet. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we need to move open. fast. Okay, so. What have we got? Ooh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I don't care if it's 90 intel or not. I'm getting an engineer here. Don't even care. Don't even care. Uh, but what I will do is I will go to the Events Warfare Center and I will decrease the time. Um, and while we're here, can I sell anything? We got a bunch of Advent Troopers. A ton of them. And all we have to boot right now is nanoscale vests. We will come across more of them, so I'm not too worried. Sectoids, I'm going to sell a few of those. We are, are going to keep one for autopsy. And then a few stun lancers. And that's it. So we just got a massive amount of supplies, of which we can use to actually buy some Hello, things, which is actually really, really good. So I think I'm going to go ahead and get the machine gun upgrade. I'm going to get those upgrades and everything, and I'm going to go in and see... Technology, along with most of what we've seen going on in the city centers, is based on variations, and in some cases, improvements of the existing alien tech used during the invasion. Luckily, the more common the stuff becomes, the easier it'll be for us to find components that can work in conjunction with the Avengers hybrid systems. So, unfortunately, it did not look like it changed much of anything in here. Secondary, the frag grenade, nah. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like it changes the name of the weapons there. But, if I go to, say, Macmillan, and I equip him with the newest Barrette 50 caliber, six to eight. Yes, please! Yes, please. Do I want to do the Desert Eagle? For Macmillan? Live it like the upgraded desert, which is three to four? Yeah, why not? <laughs> why not do that for Macmillan? I know it, the Desert Eagle is from Israel, technically. But who's to argue? Right? Who's who's really to argue about that? So I still I don't know I don't have a clue at how to go about fixing this whole weapons thing. I really, really don't. Um Yeah, we'll see. We will definitely see. Maybe when we get Goss weapons or something like that. I don't know. 
setting course for Sector 9, Western United States. Let's go ahead and continue to make contact over here in the Western U.S. Attempting to establish local region. Incoming message for you, Nice. Patching it through to your quarters now. I had high hopes for the resistance under your leadership, Commander. And you have outdone yourself. Avenger We're going to go ahead and investigate the supplies right now. And we'll come back to that. Ah, council mission. Okay. We get another engineer. Sweet. And 95 intel. Okay. For the Mexican regional tract. We won't launch this, this episode. I know this episode, in rel relatively speaking, is kind of short in comparison to a lot of my XCOM 2 campaign stuff. But uh, I think I'm going to get kind of uh, hold off there. Uh, if only we had one more day, Price could come back and get another chance. Though he's been through the ringer quite a bit, I will say. Um, now, what difficulty is this mission? It's easy. Okay, we could technically take out some squatties. And I think I will do that. We're going to take out Baker. Long shot otherwise. We're going to take out uh, Sandman. And we're going to take out Roy Sowitz. All the rest are going to be higher tiers. So I think we'll take out Grinch. And Foley. I think that's what we'll do. And uh, Grinch in particular. Can I get you? I mean, it's going to have to be the RPD. Which I don't know if I like. A hundred, no, it's actually. Wait, no. R, wait. If I go to the RPD, hold on. Ah, that's what it is. Five to seven. Okay, I don't know how wild I am about full, uh, Grinch having a, a, a Russian weapon, but that'll have to do for right now. Sacrifices must be made. As for uh, Baker here, I am going to give him the magnetic, uh, the magnetic um, Desert Eagle and the um, Barrette 50 caliber. Because I can. Roycewitz. Yeah, well, you're not going to really be useful with... Um, I lost my train of thought just now. Literally. Um, Hunter. 2-1. Medkit? You got combat protocol, so it's kind of useless. Kind of freaking useless. But then again, nothing, no, nobody really on this team so far has a pro or, um, medical protocol. So we'll just go with it for now. As for weapons, though, what I will do is I will give you a proper American weapon. Maybe the C7 this time? Yeah, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. You can have a little bit of fun with that. I want to I want to mix up the color, though, because I know I can do this, which is so freaking awesome. I can't wait! How about a bright yellow? Too much of a target? Nah. Gray. That will work. Alright, I think this is going to be the layout. Um, ooh, we need to actually get you guys some different weapons here. There we go. The M16, sure. And for Sandman, go with that. I like that approach. All right, so Operation Sentinel is the VIP mission that we're going to be doing in next episode. But that's going to do it for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. Please, as always, Hulk smash that like button. Comment in the comment section below if you're new. Do not forget to subscribe. And as always, may the force be ever in your favor.